Representing Texas Punishment Crew, this is Madison Taggart. Madison Taggart making her way down to start matchup number two here in the Grand Prix. Round one, matchup number two. And her opponent fighting out of the red. And in Gracie Baja Woodlands, this is Victoria Templeton. <laughs> This Grand Prix, I love a good Grand Prix. I love a good tournament, Scotty. Absolutely. Excited to see these styles. Both competitors looking calm and composed. Madison in on the De La Hiva here. Trying to off balance from bottom. Ops for full guard. Go, smart transition into that double leg. And you don't want to lose that grip around the back of the knees once you have it. Kind of want to walk around on that, right? Mm -hmm. Tagger transitioning into that that half guard. Inside knee, Madison. Inside knee. There you go. Keep going. Knee slide there. Knee slide. There Ooh, spin it over for the there knee bar. Are. Oh, snap. From top half to spinning Rock over for the knee bar, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely. Solid attack. It's the old boss rooting, if I'm not mistaken. Up, 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 Just up, snatch up, what up, you can up, find. Up, up, up. There you go. Great defense by Victoria. Awesome job. <coughs> when the progression of the game is crazy. Some of the stuff that was world class, you know, 20 years ago is now blue belt level. <laughs> right, right. It's the growth of the game, and you see it here. There you go, control that wrist. Pop that grip and keep it, Madison. is looking to get a deep collar tie there. Collar grip. Madison can't lose her posture. You gotta be careful. Pop that grip. Scotty, let me ask you, have you ever competed in the tournament style matchups, the Grand Prix style? Where you're like competing on a stage like this? Or competing on a stage, but then you, if, you know, tournament style where if you win your match, you'll move on to the next one. I mean, yeah, I've done like regular tournaments, but not, but not a Grand Prix. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, wait, no, no actually I have, I, I did it in Vegas once. Oh, ah, okay. There you go, let's get that knee in the middle. Is there more of a strategy? Because obviously you want to win the current matchup, so you move on, but 
you know, energy conservation has to be a factor. You can't burn yourself out in round one. Yeah, yeah. Good transition there to get past the guard. Work your way up. Work your way up. Look for the bat. Good work there. Victoria Templeton getting the cross face. She has the underhook. Now it's just a matter of time, just pressure. Got to move around past that guard. Let's get that recovery, Madison. Let's go. Victoria is fishing for the collar tie. Maybe even a gift wrap, it looks like. Turn to her, turn to her, turn to her. Who gets the gift wrap? Got a solid back take now with chest to back. Coming across the face, looking for the collar. This could seal the deal here. Taking the back, threatening with the choke. Yes, it's going to be hard for Madison to recover after this one. Absolutely. About 30 seconds left in the matchup. Templeton with a with a body lock. Just maintain control, hang in there, don't spend too much energy. If you can see a choke, take it. That is time. Good Great matchup, matchup number two, yes. Very technical. We await the judge's decision with you. Seems like it's going to take as long. Let's hop over to Bryce Boudreaux for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner via judge's decision, fighting out of the red corner, Victoria Templeton. There you see Victoria Templeton. You know, as we kind of thought, it was those submission attempts that take the lead here. And Victoria Templeton will move on to the next round of the Women's Grand Prix here at Elevate Submission Series 6.